Hey everybody, this is Matt with MDHelicoptersUSA.com. I'm uh, going to do some quick videos here for you. We are now the new U.S. and North American dealer for these fairly new King Kong 3 electronic speed controllers. They come in a various of flavors. Uh, the two right now, the top ones are the 160 amp continuous and the 200 amp continuous speed controllers soon to be followed by a 100 amp electronic speed controller as well which is still in development what we have here in front of us is a 200 amp king kong 3 electronic speed controller these just came in today we're super excited so let's go ahead and do a little unboxing and see what we have here now you'll see in front of us we've got an awesome I think it is at least. We have a uh, what seems to be a nice embossed uh, silver stamping on a matte black box. You can see here, excuse the lighting, but we have a 200 amp K3, which is the King Kong 3, 4 to 14S LiPo input, 200 amps continuous, and this is opto isolated. There is no BEC included here. So let's go ahead and slide it out and see what we have here. Okay, so inside the box we can see we actually have a nice speed controller and a USB dongle. Let's go ahead and get these out and see how these look. All right. So first things first here, let's move the box to the side. We have our speed controller. Looks to be we have 10 gauge motor output wires here, all pre-tinned. Now this is actually the red edition unit. This has a red anodized aluminum top and a black anodized aluminum bottom. This is a fully CNC'd aluminum machine case. Um, really great quality. I mean, the anodizing is great here, looks really good. Now, if we go to the side here, we actually have, again, some 10-gauge pre-tinned battery input leads. And if we look here, we can see a USB input port. This is actually for the PC programming capabilities. Now, we have over here, we have some server leads. We have one that is labeled as an upgrade cable. And we have one labeled here, which appears to be uh, to the receiver. So this is going to be our throttle input to our receiver or fly barless unit. This one here actually is to be used with the built-in RPM sensor. For those that are using an external governor, say like the uh, V-Bar or the Icon or any various fly barless units that have an incorporated governor, that's what this would be used for. So all in all, looks pretty good here. We have an incorporated fan inside of here. Okay, uh, this fan will always be on when the speed controller has power on it. And what this fan does is this removes heat from inside the speed controller and goes ahead and keeps the thing running cool at all time. So let's go ahead and set this aside and see what else we have in the box. All right, so here's the box again. Let's open this up. Oop. We have USB dongle. Here we go. This is for the King Kong 3 speed controller. There's the USB side. This already has a lead plugged into it. It looks like the other end is the termination end that actually plugs into the speed controller. Pretty cool. Don't have to order that separately. Looks like we have an RPM sensor output cable. Um, this is what we'll plug into here going into our speed controller um, and then to the other end of the fly barless unit. Um, some fly barless units may require an adapter, um, but that's easy said. Looks like we also have inside of here to be a small disc. Uh, this disc actually contains the version 5.0 configuration software for PCs. It also includes the instruction manual as well. So all in all, we've got a pretty good package here. Um, so we're going to be doing a series of videos, as I mentioned earlier. Our next video is going to be some connections. Um, everything will get soldered up. We'll get it, uh, another look at it all soldered up, 
go through the manual. Um, so we'll have we'll have a good series here with uh, with everything included. Um, so here we go. This is the unboxing of the King Kong Three High Voltage Electronic Speed Controller. This is the 200 amp. Keep in mind the 160 amp speed controller is the exact same size, exact same wires, exact same everything and features. The only thing different about it is I believe the weight is about 3 grams lighter, but everything else is exactly the same size. This unit feels pretty good. Um, quality, the video may not show it, but the quality here to me is, is really good. Um, so. Again, that's our quick look and unboxing of the King Kong 3 electronic speed controller. So if you have any questions, feel free to contact us at www.mdhelicoptersusa.com. We'd be happy to any, answer any questions for you. So until our next video, talk to you then. Bye.